My name is Brian Hayes, and in this video, I want to show you my favorite Chrome extension and a couple of the features that I use almost every single day. The extension is called Salesforce Inspector Reloaded. It's available for Chrome-based browsers as well as Firefox, and it does a ton of stuff. If you're an administrator within Salesforce, you're going to find it really valuable. And I've only scratched the surface. I only use really three features on a regular basis, and it can do a lot more than that. But these are the three that I personally find most valuable. And so this is the first feature that I'm going to show you. It's Show Fields API Names. So if you click on that tab on the right, you just scroll down a little bit, and you can click on that button. This allows you to see the API name alongside or underneath the label for all the fields that are on that particular layout. This is great because it's very common in different orgs to have multiple fields with the exact same label. Clicking on the highlighted API name here will also automatically copy it to your clipboard. Another feature I use all the time is the show all data button. If you're on a record and you click that button, it's going to update the screen and give you this long list of fields, which is fantastic because it's showing you all of the fields on the record, even the ones that are not on the page layout. Okay, let's take a look at that third feature that I use most often. So click on the inspector tab again. And if you scroll down, there's a button here for org limits. You can click on this and you get a quick overview of all of those different limits within your system and what percentage towards that limit you currently are. So in this developer uh, edition, you know, not approaching really hardly any of the limits except for some of the storage. Again, this plugin can do a lot more than what I've shown you, but even just those two first features make it well worth the effort of installing it. Being able to see those field API names and being able to see all of the fields and the data in those fields, even for ones that aren't on the layout, is a huge help when you're trying to administer Salesforce. Hope you found this video valuable. I'll see you in the next one.